Here we go. Three, two, one, 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 one. Hello, it's Pam. Dear Pam, I live in Tel Aviv and you might have heard that some bombs have been whistling over our heads. Is this any sort of world to bring a dog into? I'd love a dog. I love French bulldogs too. Do explosions scare French bulldogs? Or should I choose a hardier style of dog? Golda, Tel Aviv. I would recommend getting a dog that already lives there so so that it would already be used to the noises and not be too scared. Um, I particularly have never heard some bombs, so I probably, I'm assuming, wouldn't like them. So I would definitely suggest getting a dog from the area. Dear Pam, how do you feel about the keeping of wild fish in big tanks at places like SeaWorld? You're an intelligent animal and you like to run wild, shake balls in your mouth, paint your nails, punch out advice column answers. Why do some humans feel that they can keep something equally as awesome like an orca in captivity? Oh, jeez. Um, this is a really tricky question. Um, just recently I hurt my neck and I've been in a cage for like one week. So I know that it, it super sucks to be in a cage. But then personally, I love to see the whales in person and up close. Um... So I'm going to have to say that I think that the ones that are in captivity now, um, as long as they treat it really good, that they, they, st- they stay there. But just no, no more whales um, be brought into captivity for the future. Dear Pam, I've noticed that you have incredible style. And I'm just wondering who some of your fashion icons are and where you get some of your fashion inspiration. Nando from Maine. Oh, man. Thanks so much. Um, I really enjoy Beyonce's style. Uh, Oh, Iggy Azalea. So good. Um, I also look at Fruits Magazine, Pop Magazine, um, Nylon Magazine Good for Fashion. Um... I just like to take pieces from lots of places and just kind of make them my own.